Investigators are still piecing together all the details out there on an accident in North Collins that claimed the life of an 11 year old girl. The collision was between a car and a dirt bike and that the girl was riding and early indications are this was a horrible and tragic accident. Our Steve Brown has been on this story today and he joins us in the Information Center with more. Steve? Scott and Mary Alice, 11 year old Sydney Sedoti was out riding a small dirt bike on a beautiful summer Saturday. The accident that took her life not far from her home. This is where it happened. You can see the orange markings left by investigators. This is New Oregon Road, north of Langford in North Collins. And it is a, a rural area. It's uh, not many cars will travel that, that particular road. If you look off the road, you see a well-worn path. Right around 6 p.m. Saturday, the Erie County Sheriff's Department says the 11 year old was riding down the trail on a small dirt bike towards the road. And when she attempted to cross New Oregon Road, ran into and struck the side of a vehicle which was traveling southbound on New Oregon. So was there some sort of visible obstruction or a turn in the road at that particular point? Well, it's a narrow trail and where the trail meets New Oregon, there is certainly a obstruction to view both sides of the roadway. The driver, an unidentified woman in her 60s, stopped. An ambulance was called. Ultimately, Sedoti was brought to Oshai Children's Hospital, where she was pronounced dead. The investigation continues. No charges have been filed, and it appears the 11 year old was wearing plenty of safety gear. She was riding a dirt bike, which was both age and size appropriate for her. She was wearing a helmet and uh, in fact was wearing other protective gear such as riding boots. So all the safety precautions were there. That's likely not much consolation to Sedoti's family or the girl's classmates. She was a student in the Eden School District. The chief overseeing the ongoing accident investigation sums it up this way. This was just an absolute horrible, horrific accident. The investigation into the crash is still in its early stages. As of this afternoon, accident investigators had only spoken to the parents of the 11 year old just once, and that was very briefly on Saturday night after the accident. Reporting from the Information Center, Steve Brown, Channel 2 News.